All right. Hello, and welcome back to the Crossword Vlog, aka Clog. We are at the precipice of greatness. Um, we have a streak of five. We've solved all five days of the week up until today, Saturday. And we are at the top of the hill. Saturday is the hardest uh, day of the week. Sunday's bigger but easier. And if we can get this, we will tie our best streak of all time. And that was a long time ago, uh, not recorded at all. So this would be a huge accomplishment for me. I'm gonna take a sip of water. Sorry for the awful sound <laughs> and get right into it. Let's go. Braveheart villain. Um, <laughs> didn't watch the movie, but it might be like the somethings. Um, but I'm just gonna actually just go through every single one of the acrosses and every single one of the downs. Um, I have no desire to do this speedily, so we're just gonna try to do it as methodically as possible. Um, status could be rep, like reputation. I know I said I was gonna go through the acrosses, but I'm always gonna look at the... Um... Ah, okay. <laughs> you see how quickly I uh, break for my plan? But um, so status could be rep, like reputation. And then Qatar is one of the United Arab Emirates, um, such as Abu Dhabi. Um, and there are a bunch of them. Uh, Monodin Monoceros, more familiarly. That must be like the Latin name of some, um, some animal. Oh, I wonder if it's a unicorn. Um, like maybe that's some fake name for a unicorn. I'm just literally just looking at mono. I'm not gonna put that in because that's that's a big uh, that's a big reach, but it's a possibility. Um, defense secretary under Obama. Was that Colin Powell? Uh, that doesn't fit. Um, Powell was under Bush anyway. Um, Pataki or something? No, that that's the good governor of New York. Um, okay. Like day something. Uh, don't know what that means. Utah home of Weber State University. Okay, this is, and I have no idea what that is. But that is an auspicious sign. Uh, fans of the original blog will know what Weber means to me. Um, and you might find out if I manage to solve this puzzle. Shell game. Shell game. Dar es Salaam is a thing. I don't know what it means. It just came to me. Uh, ending with love or tap. Ending. I can't. It might be a tricky clue where it means literally something that ends with love or tap, or it could be a suffix of those two. Marion something, don't know. 20th century map and knits. Okay, let's think. Um, so in the 1900s, you'd think it would be SSR or something, something related to the USSR? Could be. Um, was it not Charles Lindbergh? that flew solo around the world? But 1933, that seems too early for that. Um, question. Hmm. Okay, I think Alternating current was created by 
Nikola Tesla. Um, oh, maybe fly solo around the world. The 1933 might... Because I thought the first airplane was in like the 19, like the late 1920s. So I, I don't think someone like that soon after would fly all the way around the world. Maybe I'm going crazy. No, because in the 19, in 1945, we had like bomber planes. So well, 20 years is a long time. <laughs> My history knowledge isn't great, but. Um, I don't even know if I spelled Lindbergh correctly in the first place. So, gesture signifying perfection. Chef's kiss, maybe? Part of a plan, but with a question mark. Could be like a blueprint related thing. Okay, tip of a writing implement. I think the nib of a pen. Circuit building block. Like a hmm. Okay. Cash crop of South America. Mm, four letters too. I don't think it would be like rice. Okay, use curlers on, match, like many a shoot in shoots and ladders. Hmm. Okay. Well, I, I cheated is the wrong word, but <laughs> I broke with my promise. I, I did end up looking at this down, even though I'm supposed to be looking at the acrosses, and this is DIY kits. Um, I, like, I know that's not right, Snake, like, because there's snakes and ladders, which is what I always played, which is the same exact game. Um, but anyway, we'll, we'll keep going. Poorly suited, mm. grilled meat to dishes, ground. There's like space command or something like that. Small plane for short flights. Um, could be like a hopper or something. No. Well, I know a Cessna, mm, no, that doesn't quite work. Made into course, okay. <laughs> um, entourage, remotes can get lost in sofa cushions, brought out. Don't know. Okay. A veneer is like a, a thing you put on top of something. Award in a lawsuit. Don't know. So I was thinking unicorn. Let, let me think back to this. Um, okay, maybe a rhino? Oh, yeah, yeah, like rhinoplasty um, is uh, plastic surgery on your nose, so a rhino. There we go. Field of informatics, no idea. No matter what. The opposite of cut. I 
has a list. Hmm. Probably ends with S. Um, maybe not. Method of music education. Huh. I don't know what Super G is. A doofus could just be an ass. Who is that? You might say when looking at a family photo album. Abbreviation on a receipt. On a receipt. Maybe C and T for like count. Part of a plan. Hmm. Joint venture. Maybe related to like joints in your body. Okay. Circular argument. It might have like no logic. Ice blue glacier. Um, bad something maybe? Coca, I guess. Um, kebabs are grilled meat dishes. Bad seed, corrupt by nature. And this could be kebabs as well. Um, so I'll keep that in mind. Pays a fair to get there. Cabs too. Maybe you can verbify cab, um, like takes a cab too. SGLE looks a little bad. Okay. <laughs> yeah, maybe not. Um, entourage. Brought out. Hmm. Atkins diet no no. I thought Atkins was like a no carb diet. Um so like bread or something like that. Must has to relationship phrase is to, like the relationship between different things, not like romantic relationships. Program file suffix should be exe, I would think. And then lead into course. Yeah, something, yeah. A small plane for short flights. Could it be an air taxi? I haven't heard of that, but it just sort of makes sense. Like you might take an air taxi instead of a regular taxi for a short ride. Um, his course? Miss course? His course? <laughs> um, not sure, but these letters all look great down here. So I feel, I feel pretty confident about all that. Um, Could be like Laurie or something. Ground. Could be like ground a circuit. Unfit. Poorly suited. Joint venture. Something arm or maybe form. Uh, 
Okay. Huh. You almost want this to be a C, because CK looks good, and SCH, there's not many other things that could be. Um, but gold, like what does that mean? Um, okay. And it definitely does not look like it was Lindbergh. So. All right, let's take another lap. Um, okay, this is definitely not unicorn. <laughs> um, I don't know what that's supposed to elicit there. Um, yeah, I think my best bet is to try to make progress over in these areas and try to get another thing up here so I can break in. Um, I say as I look, <laughs> I look at these again. Like I think if I spent enough time here, I might be able to come up with something, but I think I'm gonna have better luck um, trying to shoot up this way. Okay. Joint venture. Do I think it's A or O? I think it's got to be one of those. Okay, ground. Okay, a logic gate, so no logic is wrong, because you can't have uh, repeats of words in a crossword, uh, which is very handy to know for things like this, but um, in like computer circuits, logic gates uh, are, you know, used for everything. Um, I could nerd out about that a bunch, but I will not. Um, so no something else. So that cab two could be right. Cabs two, okay, maybe not. <laughs> Just based off of this. Um, but Okay, let's not get too distracted. Um, abbreviation on receipt. Yeah, I don't know what that's gonna be. This is probably Lonnie, Detective Lonnie Briscoe. Hmm. Okay, well, come back to here. Circular argument has. Oh, actually, a lot of this could be wrong. Although Coca seemed all right. Retinue. I I don't know what to say about that other than it's just a synonym for entourage. Um, Mr. T, I, I was just thinking of like what names can fit in there and Mr. T is a, a classic. Uh, missile command, okay. A circular argument has no point because circular circles have no points. <laughs> um, trotted out maybe? Cabs it, and I just spelled retinue wrong. 
Okay. <laughs> what? Huh. S-shaped. Oh my gosh. I was like, what word could possibly fit here? Um, and then Super G must be some ski brand. And then, you know, there's some other brand that ends with skier, I guess. But that's great. Um, only took us 20 minutes, but <laughs> we filled out an entire corner of the board and some more to boot. Um, okay. I'm wondering if this could end with science. It can. Okay, part of a plan. Hmm. I feel like this is going to be like whitey someone because they had weird names back then. Shell game. Could it be something toss? This might be something line. Alpine skier, maybe? Something line. Let's try that. Stone line, mm, don't love that. Match. Could it be set? Could it be so? Oh, maybe C, like in poker, like I see your bet. I match your bet. Music education. This just doesn't look like a word to me. I'm still thinking this could have something to do with blueprints, but I'm not sure. Okay, um, no matter what, something else maybe? Oh, this doesn't look right. That could be wrong. I mean, that could also be wrong, but PL, yeah. I mean, it doesn't have to be else, it just felt possible. No matter what. It doesn't need to be. Something age, maybe? All right, let's see if we can Close out this corner. Okay, what was this? What if this is a arm? In Ashen. <laughs> Doesn't have to be Lonnie, I guess. Could be like Lenny, even. Um, okay. I'll come back to this area. I don't see a ton of value in pushing in it. Um, and, you know, it's not like it goes stale. Okay. Yeah, let's look at all this again. Okay. 
shoddy treatment monodon so i know loxodon is elephant monodon looks similar to an elephant but with one tusk Ooh, if it's tusk related maybe it's a narwhal the unicorn of the sea um Oh darn. Aw, oh, geez. Maybe. Like a very Rick and Morty thing to say. Mostly Morty. Okay. Ending with a Z, okay. Bottom of a barrel. I mean, it doesn't need to be odd G's. It could be aw something else, but. Aw uh, rats, maybe? Because then this could be toss again. And then. Hmm. Hmm. Let's see. <laughs> this might end with like an A. So, I still feel like it ends with else, but I, it's just not, <laughs> There's not that many phrases like that. Win or else, okay. Where win or else isn't really no matter what, but. Okay. Remnant is like a little piece. I think it would be like aura or something. Um. Okay, what if this ends with us? Yeah, I don't know. Might not, it really might not end in S. Like it might be something S here and then two or something. Okay. Stone line. Okay, so this is almost certainly a vowel. So Catalina or something could make sense. I don't think, I mean, could be a name that looks much less likely. So O, o or A. Let's start with A. Hmm. <laughs> Doesn't really look very name friendly here. Something here could definitely be wrong. Like, for example, it doesn't need to be science, nor does it need to be toss. Could be. Um, yeah, yeah, data, data science. Getting a little bit of help here. I'll still count it though. <laughs> no, no. Uh, feel free. Braveheart villain. Okay, this could be S. Am I right? 
sweet du diable, whatever. Um, the day after today, um, man, or manana, yeah. Manana. It's just with the tilde, right? Yeah. Uh, Manana. I'm sure. Yeah. Well, <laughs> I'll figure it out. I'm terrible at spelling. Manana. Man. Manana. Yeah, okay. Okay. It's all right. All right. I was, I was I was getting tweaked out there. All right. Um, and then. Enamels, maybe. Goodbye. All right. Got a little bit of help, but I'm I'm still gonna <laughs> I'm not gonna count that against myself. Thank you. Thank you for the help. Um bottom of the barrel. Award in a lawsuit. Okay, maybe this is SSR. Could it be Edwards? I don't know. Uh, you can get thrown through the ringer. Okay. Bottom of the barrel. Could it be lies or something? Ang toss? Egg toss, maybe? Shell game? Because eggs have shells. Damages. You can be awarded damages. Edward. Okay. Well, that looks like another corner filled. Okay, yeah. What if this is just pass again? And then, I mean, doesn't really help with much. Remnant. Abject humiliation. It's like get egg on your face or something, like one of those weird idioms or something. I think if you're listful, it means that you like want something. Um, so it could be yearn, but you'd think it'd be yearns, plural. Um, yeah, you really would. Has a list. 
Man, what if both of these were wrong? <laughs> um, okay, what if it was win or else? Raw deal might be a shoddy treatment. You've been given a raw deal. Remnant, dreg, dregs. American Medical Association that's got the snake around the codicus. Um, eat crow. It was one of those weird idioms, I think. Okay, something's very wrong here. Um, Opposite of cut, love, uh, og, <laughs> um, looks pretty bad here. This curls on surfage. Music as an education. Lead into course. Maybe it's like a class course. Tis course. Discourse. Okay. Okay. So we know this ends with shed. Um, ground. I uh, still don't know exactly. Okay, just want to see if there's anything I haven't looked at in a while. Opposite of cut to be attach. Uh, but it may be something else. <laughs> um, just because RC does not look very promising. Panetta, maybe? Has a list. Leans or something? Could be like Ogden, that sounds like a place. Eat dirt? Tapas? <laughs> Tapic? Tapics? Levies? Has a list, leans? Um, I'm definitely <laughs> not confident on any of that, but um, feels good to at least have something in there and then we can adjust later. Um, whitey plot, whitey plat. No matter what, when or else. Cattle, Katie, 
Marion Cavalier. <laughs> uh, that doesn't seem right. And you really uh, question everything when you get to this point. I'm like, could unfit be wrong? Like, I don't think so. But like, I almost want this to be a B here, like something bar. Um, okay, I'm just gonna put letters in and see if something looks like a word to me. Sugar. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Sometimes that all you that's all you need. Um uh, Okay, ground. You can grind your teeth or you can gnash your teeth. And this is gonna be linear, Lonnie. Um, use curlers on. Stong line. <laughs> Could it end with farm and not something arm? I mean, could. Okay, use curlers on. Maybe a joint venture could cow farm. I don't know about that. Um, part of a plan. <laughs> like at this point, I'm just thinking about Okay. Set, set. Change maybe on a receipt. Um. Set. Part of a plan could be a phone line. Um, joint venture. Pow farm. Pot farm. Okay. Use curlers on. Set. Maybe you can set here. I don't think sot would work there. So. Um, Katie Lear, Lee, we are PLST. <laughs> that does not seem right. 
Okay. Let's give a look over everything else in here because there's some other stuff that I didn't feel good about. Um, okay, phone line, logic gate, chef's kiss. Those are all definitely right. Sat, fridge. Okay, opposite of cut, attach. That makes a ton of sense to me. Has a list. Okay. Lo okay, eat dirt could totally be wrong. Okay, what if these were all right? Love Whitey Alpine seems right. I mean, else could still be wrong if this was going to be ass. Kate. Marion, cat, win or lose, no matter what. Oh, no matter what, win or lose, this is what's going to happen. Whitey posh or something? Whitey post, maybe. Eat dirt. Catalar. Okay, okay. It's a little too much to hope for, for this all to be right. Um, Catalar. Catalark, attack. Um, okay, I'm just gonna do, I feel like we're really close. I think we're gonna get this actually. Um, but I'm just going to go through everything, make sure there's no like typos or like weird things. Um, Panetta, that could definitely be wrong. Manana, Ogden, could be wrong, yeah. Egg Toss, Dars, X, The Lees. Well, Damages and ringers are definitely right. All rats seems right. I mean, that, that does not look right. Um, SSR, whitey post, could be a name. Phone line, nib, logic gate, coca. Set could be wrong, but Lenny seems good in pop farm. Yeah. That seems all right. Match, C, S-shaped, unfit, kebabs, mashed, missile, air taxi, retinue, remotes, trotted, enamels, damages, ringers, all rats, rhino, data science, SLE, well, everything else seems okay. Medical Association. Win or, L, or win or lose, okay. Dreg. Eat dirt. Attach means, yeah, that, that corner needs some work. Oh, satfidge. Okay, the only thing here that could be wrong, in my opinion, is the, the first A, or the only A, I guess. I mean, Whitey could be wrong, but I, I think that's just a name, and nothing else would be a name. DIY kits, Alpine Skier, Tesla. Who is that? Change, Pop Farm, No Point, Ice Blue, Bad Seed, Lenny, Cabzit, Sugar, Has To, Is To, EXE, Discourse. Mr. T. Okay. 
General Panetta Okay. Cat. Cut. Okay. I feel like it all comes down to this one. Ending with love or tap. Love. <laughs> love okay, tap tap ons <laughs> I just like attach here so much could be eat Dust, Catalash. Eat Dust. Catalash. I mean, that looks much more like a thing. Love. Tap ears, tap ears. Okay, I know that's, but love, love ears is not a thing, but tap ears is an animal. Okay. <laughs> um, okay. Okay, back to dust. Um, love. Ending with love or tap. Gosh, could be Og Den. That looks more like a thing. Opposite of cut, maybe attend. I don't know. <laughs> Attached just seemed so good. I don't know why I'm so sure it's Ogden. And I'm not sure why I'm so sure it's Leans. So maybe I'll go back to that. Katie, Cattle. Cat a latch. Love box. Tapox. Tap tapex. Man. Has a list. I think that's gotta end with an S. That's the thing. I just can't see a way for it not to. Oh, Panetta doesn't need to be right. Okay, it doesn't need to be eat something, technically. Oh, Lady Post would be a funny name.
Panetta just seems so good. But I know I've gotten trapped by that sort of thought before. Utah home. I don't know like, if that's supposed to help me. It's just going to be some random town name. Man, I just feel so good about Panetta and Lean's Attach. And I just feel so bad about this one. Got a laugh? Eat putt. Yeah, I feel like it's got to be dirt or dust, but neither of those, like dust looks a lot better, but love, yeah, maybe I'm just not parsing that clue correctly and it's fine, but <laughs> and it just looks awful. And then Sotfidge. Kotalash. Chef's kiss, phone line, logic gate, C. Okay. I think what I'm going to do, it's currently 11, 11 p.m., which is past my bedtime. <laughs> I am going to sleep on this, and this is not going to be broken into two videos because I know how to edit them together now, um, and in just a few seconds, I will teleport forward several hours with a fresh brain, and I'm going to look over it again because I really think we can get this done, but until then, see ya. All right, I'm back. Um, you might have noticed a different form factor in the screen or something. I'm just playing on a different monitor at the moment. Um, so what was seconds for you was hours for me. Um, it is Saturday morning. I started solving on Friday night. So let's just get back into it and see if fresh eyes um, help me out. The first thing I'm going to do, I, I remember, of course, that this was my um, problem area. But I'm just going to go through everything once more and see if anything looks off. Like, for example, Edwards as a villain seems off. Like, you'd think it would be Edward the First and then Eel do Diablo. Um, wow. <laughs> yeah, Edward the First was a king. And then eel means like isle, um, which would make sense for a penal colony. Okay, well that's encouraging. Um, am I right? Yeah, that seems all right. Panetta, ugh, it, it just doesn't sound right to me. Um, but I'm just going to ignore the, the top right corner as I do this. Out on the barrel, Lees. Lees. I mean, everything else just seems so correct that it's hard for me to imagine Lees being wrong. Um, I just don't know what's going on there. Um, okay, Whitey Post. <laughs> That's a weird name. Um, no offense if that's actually correct. All right, chef's kiss, phone line, nib, logic gate, coca, set, use curlers on. You can like set your hair by putting curlers in it, perhaps. Uh, S-shaped, unfit, kebabs, 
Nashed Missile Air Taxi Retinue Remotes Trotted Enamels Yeah All of these seem pretty good American Metal Medical Association is that is that AMA? Sounds right. Okay, dreg. Eat. Eat dust doesn't seem great, but okay, we're gonna come back to that area. Okay, so <laughs> egg toss. Egg toss is totally a game. Match. Could match be anything else? Can't be set, because this is set. Um, match a bet. I, I, I think that is right. But, okay. What can be wrong here? Who is that's got to be right? So, Marion... Surfage? Like it could be like surfage, something like that. It just that just doesn't look like a thing. Music education. Sure something. God, yeah, I'm Chef's Kiss, yeah. Phone line, logic gate. Yeah, like even if I pretend that it could be something other than C, like these letters just don't mean anything to me. That's what's tripping me out. Okay. Um, let's keep going through here. Doofus. I'm going to take this out as well. Who is that? Change seems all right. Pot farm, yeah. No point. Ice blue, bad seed. Lenny Briscoe. Could be Lonnie. Use curlers on, no. Lanny, sat, no, sit. Lenny? No. Okay, I think it's Lenny. Cabs it. No sugar. Has to. Is to. EXE. Discourse. And then Mr. T. Okay. So let's, let's get rid of all of these things. Emerit and raw deal. Okay, so, earn something, maybe? Cut could be potentially in relation to like a sports team like cut off a team so you could be on the A team or something but that doesn't fit anyway okay what okay if you're listless if you're listless <laughs> that means you don't have a direction um like you're just wandering about So, okay, so tap ins is a thing in golf. Um, like it's a, you know, when you get it really close to the, the hole and you just tap it in. But is love ins a word? Um, 
happens. It, it totally is. Okay, so eat, if this was eat dirt, um, what could N be here? Because I was, I was so locked in on attach. Um, cut, maybe attend or something. No, attend doesn't make sense, I don't think. Well, let's try it out. Cut attend. What, what could attend mean other than like going to a function? You can attend to someone, which means like take care of them or like pay attention to them. It could, it could, I could see a world in which that was right. Um, and I, I think has a list could be leans. Because if you don't have a direction, you're listless. But if you lean towards something, maybe you have a list. I might be reaching a bit. Catalord, Catalard. Marion, Catalar. You know, you know, like it. Marion something. You know, La Vie en Rose. Uh, Unless it's a French film, I, I think. <laughs> um, so, you know, the Catalar looks like a French name. You see, I'm, I'm obviously <laughs> reaching a bit here, but, and then we'll, we'll put ass back. Um, every, every good puzzle's got to have ass in it. Oh, gosh. Well, let's just put it in. Okay, still wrong. Um, tap ins. Ogden just sounds like a place, you know? That's what's getting me. All right, we should put a time limit on this. I think if we get to 1.15 and we haven't figured it out, that'll be my, my time to stop. Whitey post. Why do I keep thinking that's right? <laughs> I guess it's just because, like, what else could it be? Like, that's a name. Um, love, love ins. Tap ins. Like, tap ins is totally a thing. That's what's. And that's like better than any of the other things that I've tried here, which <laughs> nothing was ever a thing. Panetta. Um, Panetta seems potentially off. Okay, but this this is the worst part. Sat Fitch. Like everything else in here is like kind of acceptable, like Panetta, Ogden, sure. But Sat Fitch is just so clearly not a word. I mean it's it's possible that it's right, but I I would be kind of upset if Sat Fitch was actually correct, honestly. Totalard? Not like not like that looks any better, but Okay, music education. Could method be a last name? And then this is another name? Okay. Take this out. Take this out. Cotillar? Cotillar, that looks maybe more like a name than Catalar. Cotillar. Name. Okay. But not that it helps here, but. 
Wiley Poost? Sulf? Sulfage? <laughs> I mean, what? Oh my god! <laughs> That's apparently correct. Oh my gosh. We finally did it. Um, Before I admire the puzzle, there's a huge tradition on, well, originally the blog, but now this channel. And we've got to go to YouTube for this. You know, you already know what it is. Although the audio is not going to come through, but I'm going to hear it. And that's what matters. Um, I'll, I'll post a link to this in <laughs> in the chat, if it ever loads, uh, or in the comment section. Um, no, please, please let me have this moment. It's all I've ever wanted. Oh, no. <laughs> YouTube won't let me. Um, Oh, it's probably because of my headphone setup. Oh, you already you already know what this is, though. Um, I'll I'll put a link in the channel and I'll listen to it on my own time. But to quote from memory, strike to claim it, strike to claim it, and he did it. God damn it, that's right. I never thought. Are you kidding me? Who do you think you are? I am. Seen. Um, yes, uh, whenever we solve a Saturday crossroad, that's mandatory viewing. Um, it took a lot. Um, we had a little help from my, my girlfriend in this corner, but I, I don't think that was going to be the, the make or break there. No offense. It, it did. It definitely did, um, help me solve it faster, but I, I think I would have eventually puzzled those out. So I, I, I feel confident you know, counting this as a, as a true win. Um, and I, yeah, I feel great. Um, I do have to say the Sulfage Cotillard, Cotillard cross is disgusting. <laughs> let's go ahead. You know, let, let's take a victory lap. Let's, let's look up what Sulfage is. Um, the application of the sol fa symbols to a musical scale or melody. Ooh, mm. that is not something I am familiar with. Um, I I get how you could potentially reason that out. Like you see S O L, you're like, oh, sol fa, but it's not even like solfege, like with an A there. Um, so I really do not like seeing that in a grid. And let's look up Cotillard. Um, she is indeed, oh, this person, she was in Inception. Um, I mean, not that that information would have helped me, um, but yeah, she wasn't in Inception, right? She was like the, the wife of, yeah, okay. She, she played Mal, okay. Um, I, I think it was correct of them to reference Love Young Rose instead of Inception, though, to make the clue a little easier, because I, I knew that it was going to be a French name, so I didn't feel as bad about it. Um, let's go take a look at Wiley Post. Wiley Post. Um, oh, he did fly in an actual plane. Man, I'm, I'm so dumb. <laughs> I, was, I was like, this man must have taken a hot air balloon or something. Um, but... Yeah, wow. That was that was a struggle. I battled this puzzle. Um, but it also shows the power of a fresh set of eyes. Um, I remember last night when I was just going through and um, you know, looking through everything, I was like, oh Edwards, yeah, yeah, I'm sure that's right. And then Slee, yeah, I'm sure that's right. Um, but you know, just another look. I'm like, you know, Edwards doesn't really make sense as a as a villain name. So, yeah, um, we've finally tied our streak of most, well, our, our longest streak of uh, daily crosswords solved. Um, that feels incredible. And we're also, you know, over the hump, so to speak. Uh, you know, the, the title of this channel is Saturday Stump Us, and... You know, we stumped the Saturday this time, although it came very close to stumping us. Um, tomorrow, 
I guess I've I've been skipping the the Sunday puzzles because I don't really like Sunday puzzles very much. But now that we're on a streak, um, I'm definitely going to attempt the Sunday puzzle and try to get our streak to seven. If we can get it there, there's no there's no telling how far we can make it because you know Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, you know, those are almost free at this point in my solving career. So I am extremely excited to battle that Sunday and, and see what we can do there. Anyway, in terms of a rating here, I, I think that Solfage is really gross, crossed with an obscure name, pretty nasty. There's, I, I, I still don't know what Lovins is. Um, I don't think this was a, a bad puzzle by any means, but I, I, I do think there were a few bits in here that I wasn't super happy about. Plus, it was a little cramped in here. Um, you know, you sort of have to squeeze into these corners, which is a little um, unfun as a solving experience. So I think I would give this a solid 6.5 out of 10. Um, honestly, I should just give it a 5 because I usually think Saturdays are good puzzles. So this seems like an average Saturday. But I'm, I'm sort of experiencing inflation in my grading scale. Um, so I'll, I'll give it a 6.5. Anyway, um, I hope you all enjoyed that as much as I did. Uh, and I'll see you in the next one on the Sunday. Let's get it done.